को माथी डाना मार सामान में ये ओम पूरी और ये भी दोनों बीच में ऐसे C'est ma première visite aussi au Népal et je viens de Belgique. Et où tu viens de Belgique. Belgique. Et où est-ce que tu viens de Maud. Maud. Oui. Ok. Excellent. Tu veux dire quoi Non. Tu veux dire quoi Ok. Um, Nathalie, what do you think about the country Nepal? Hmm. Nepal for me is like another home. As I said, I've been here before. I really like that mix. Of Hindu uh, and Buddhists, like when we visit the temple, that the two religions are hand in hand together. The energy is really soft, and at the same time, we feel a very strong energy. So this is what I like mostly: the spirituality in Nepal. So, what do you have to say about the people in this country? How the, do you, the people how do you... are very soft, also very welcoming, very easy, always smiling, there to help you. So it's, it's you should definitely welcome. You're more than welcome. You should definitely visit Nepal. Do you speak some Nepalese words? No. Tore uh, tore. I need to learn more. Tore tore. How many words you can speak in? No. Well, the numbers, a little bit the numbers, the food. Uh, What's your best, uh, like favorite food? <laughs> Mo well, the classic Mongo <laughs> dal bhat. Uh, I love Kanna, so that's yeah. So I will learn soon. It's just that I was busy with other projects, but uh. my intention is to learn Nepali a little bit more. Yes. So, um, besides being Nepal really good, nice, everything. What other things that you have complaints about? Uh, this, not dislike, but something that you want to see as improvement in Nepal. Something that definitely the roads. <laughs> the roads, uh, pollution, unfortunately, like the dust. Uh, traffic gets really, really bad, of course. And I know it's not just for me. Even more like for uh, local people, especially in Kathmandu. So that would be very nice if it could be improved. So then, also for local people, it would be easier for them to travel, and for tourists also, they wouldn't be like so like afraid of visiting, let's say, a big city like Kathmandu. What do you think about it? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Un monde à, à découvrir et à apprendre. Ça fait juste deux jours, fait que j'ai pas eu le temps de, de, de m'imprégner de, de, de l'environnement. He only arrived two days ago, yeah. so it's still very fresh. Yeah. So today is the first visit day. Uh, we just spent the morning uh, puja in a monastery now here in Swayambu. We're going to Balda, we're going to Pashupatina. So definitely already by the end of the day we'll have a better idea of uh, Nepal. And lastly, what do you think about Nepal's people? Yes, uh, it's the same. I just arrived in two days and then uh, it's so fresh. But I'm so surprised for, because the people are very welcoming, smiling and um, it's very soft. And I'm feeling uh, a lot of energy and emotion. I'm so emotional. Because
because um, I feel a lot of pain and uh, it's beautiful for me. A lot of colorful. Do you know any Nepalese language? Any words? Namaste. My name is uh, Cecilia. Hello, Nepal. And where you come from? I come from Denmark. Okay. What's come in your mind first that when ne Nepal country as you think when word about Nepal? Well, first when Nepal came into my mind was in my home in Denmark, and uh, it was uh, I was reading about Nepal, and uh, I have to say it was a dream to come here. Uh, I read about uh, how friendly you are, uh, what a uh, great nature Nepal has um, and so far I was arriving yesterday but so far uh, I think really 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 warm people and really uh, welcoming and helpful and uh, yeah I like the second question is, do yes. you know any words, Nepalese word, Nepalese language word, anything that you Namaste. Know? Namaste. And that anything else? Anything else more? Danyavat. And more? Try Na Nahain. Nahain. Ha. 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 Uh, I replied it and you also replied it, okay? Yes. What is your name in our Nepalese language? Say, Topiko Nam Kiho. Topiko Nam Kiho. Kiho. Yeah. Again, Top you can try it. Topiko Nam Kiho. And you replied it. Topiko Nam Kiho. My name is Miro Nam. Miro Nam. Yeah, your name say, okay? Cecilia. Oh, Ho. Ho. Right. Okay. Oh, and third question is Do you know where was Buddha was born in? In which country? Uh, Lunipur? Lumbini, yes. Lumbini, yes. But uh, some Indian people are saying that, criticizing that uh, Gautam Buddha was born in their country, India. I know, yes. So what are going to say about that? Well, I mean, there is always this fight. Even Denmark and Sweden has also some fights about which belongs to where. Um, so I don't know what I can say other than the history I've been reading is so far that he was born in Lumbini. In Nepal country? Yes. Okay, and fourth question is, do you know any Nepalese tradition and culture? Do you know anything? I know that it's, uh, um, how to say, you give, um, you never point with the feet when a person is uh, eating. Yeah. And I know also that you always greet with the hands in front of your chest. And I also know that you always take your shoes off and never give with the left hand. Um, and so far, that's it. Okay, and do you know any things that uh, do you dislike or likes about Nepal? 
What should we remain for Nepal as a country? Mm, no, I, I, there is nothing I dislike. I haven't been here long enough uh, to, but there, so far nothing I dislike. I love the food and the people. And do you know any Nepalese food? Do you know anything? I just had a very nice samosa. Samosa? <laughs> yes. <Momo. laughs> Did you try it? Yes, I tried. Uh, this is like? It tastes really nice. Okay. Yeah, it is. It's it's lovely with the spicy and the sweet together. Hmm? And in which place did you visit in Nepal? Um, so now I'm in Kathmandu, and then I will travel to uh, Chitwan. Chitwan. And then I will travel. Uh, I will stay in Nai Narayana, Narayani. Yeah, and then I would travel from there to Pokhara, from Pokhara to uh, Dam Dam village in Kar Karshi district, I think. Kashki, yes. Yeah. So, Thank okay, you. Lastly, question is: yes? do, you, do you have any message from your friends to call? Uh, please come in our Nepal country to visit everything. So, any message from your side, you can say. It. To, uh, to 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 my friends, yeah. yes. Okay, I would Denmark, say, to yes, to Denmark. To Denmark, I would say, go visit Nepal. It's amazing and you will love it. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>
uh, anyone who visits here will never regret. Yeah. Why? 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 Anyone who have the opportunity to visit Nepal will never regret. My my, my question is, why do you visit Nepal? Sorry? Why do you visit Nepal? Yeah, for adventure. Okay. Yeah. Just for adventure. Yeah, for adventure and for holidays. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah.